Well, greetings. It is a chilly afternoon up here. I'm up on, I'm back up on Short, uh, Short Mountain. I was here a month or more ago, but I was on the north side checking out some abandoned mining stuff. And now I'm coming to the, I'm going to go down to the south side, see what's down there. I was told I might have more luck seeing some cool stuff down there. And uh, from looking at the Google Maps and stuff, it looks like there might be, we'll see. Looks like there might be some old cars or buildings even. Of course, they may not be there anymore, depending on how old those images are from Google Earth. But uh, I just stopped to take a break here and uh, I'm up on top of the mountain. Now I'm gonna descend down, see what's on down here. So as always, I'm gonna take you with me and we'll check things out here together. Now here's an interesting area. Might check the things out over there, but there's a looks like we'll get a nice look out over there. We'll check that out too then. Yes, yeah, so this area up here definitely looks like could have been a tunnel here at one time or something. But if there was, it's nothing here now. Oops. Yeah. I think I'll go on and check out that view down there. This looks like a pretty neat view out here. Some trees in the way though. Well, that's pretty cool down there too. Whoa, let's check that all out too. I'll be on the way back, but that's looking down into the, the Lycans Valley out there. But yeah, there's a lot going on down there. Probably can't tell in the camera too much, but that looks interesting. All right, let's keep exploring. Well, here's a tree-free view. Down. Like I said, this looks pretty cool. That's pretty steep going on down there. Well, there still is some stuff up here, so that looks good. Hopefully there's more, we'll check this out. Some giant piece of machinery here. Oh, all kinds of yeah, all kinds of neat gears and stuff. Look, there was a cable on there. It looks like doesn't look very, too old either. Got this here with it. Looks like this was standing upright at one time. Maybe like a head frame or something for the mine. Oh yeah, I do see some buildings down there. I'll check that out in a moment. Cool. Yeah, it looks like maybe this was what they call a head frame that was on top of the mine. That was the used to pull the elevator up and down, I guess, maybe, huh? Yeah, there is some quite a bit here. There's a gated off pipe. Oh yeah. There's a mine down there. Huh, cool. So they probably uh, filled this in around here. Gated this off. Cool. I'll get my flashlight out. Shine it down there. Well, the flashlight doesn't help too much. It shows a little bit down there. Yeah, I can I can see if you could get down there, you could go off in either direction. Cool. But yeah well, can't get down there. Alright, let's look at some of this other stuff out here. <coughs> this is a this is like a fan. I mean this one looks fairly not look too old either. All kinds of pallets out here. Let's see what's in here. Just a 
bunch of machinery, it looks like. Oh, look, the other end is open, let's go over there. Yeah, there's a big tank in here and some mesh, wire mesh. Yeah, so these are the things that on Google Earth I wasn't sure were buildings or cars. But, you know, somewhere halfway in between they are. So, cool, that stuff is still up here. This is on state game lands, and usually this stuff gets cleaned up. Uh, the game commission doesn't usually leave this stuff out here, but, you know, it usually gets cleared off and scrapped. So it's kind of neat to see it's still out here. I'm going to keep looking around here a little bit. Yeah, there's just a lot of stuff laying out here. All, all that steel cable. Lots of scrap metal. More machinery back there. More steel cable. Interesting. So there's some kind of definitely some kind of operation going on here. Well, yeah, because there was that coal mine up there. I don't know if that was the only entrance they're working in now. Well, I'm gonna move on now. It's definitely a cool find. So, hopefully there's some other stuff up here. Look like on Google Earth there might be some more stuff to the <coughs> further to the east yet. Hopefully there is. So let's keep going, keep exploring. Good day so far. Looks like there's another <coughs> gated entrance up here yeah oh cool yeah goes in there's definitely a tunnel back in there oh, it'd be cool to explore in there but yeah well and here's yet another one oh man it looks awesome in there well there is warm air coming out of this one whoops I see my camera just falls up and my glasses sheesh You know how you can see in there, the camera keeps fogging up. There's warm air coming out of this one. That is weird. I've never experienced that before. I don't know if there's a... Huh. Interesting. Alright. Cool. That's not even focusing. Yes, yeah, so that one's definitely interesting. Looks like it's plugged up. There's some stuff in there. It's plugging it up. A bunch of wooden stuff too, but there's definitely a lot of warm air coming out of that one. Never experienced that before. I don't know if there's a... Well, I guess there wouldn't be a fire down there maybe, but... Anyway. That was cool. <laughs> Lots of old trash just laying around too. Aircraft hydraulic oil. I'll have come to the end of the road here, but I do want to go down. There's some trenches down there I want to check out, but I gotta, gotta find a safe way to get down there. The, the top side of these trenches tend to be pretty steep, and I don't want to fall down anymore. Get out there, it's a ton of lichens, I think. Alright, so I'm gonna try and find a safe way to get down, down there. Well, I think I'm gonna backtrack and try to get down a different way. It's hard to tell on camera, but it's pretty steep here and then it just drops right down in the trenches. Not really a good combination there. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna hike back a little bit on some of these old roads and then I think there was one that a road that actually led down to this area, so that's where I'm gonna go to next. Do things the safe way. Yeah, I just found it looks like another uh, capped off entrance to a shaft. It's like a cement pad put here. This, this is right above one of the other uh, gated mines that we were at. That's what this is. Yeah, so I'm down in 
one of those big trenches, and this is why I didn't want to come from the top side, because it's steep up beyond that, and then it just ends abruptly into a ditch. That's quite a fall, so. I'm just gonna chill here for a bit, take a break. Got some hot chocolate mixed with eggnog. It's pretty good. If you like eggnog. Some people don't like eggnog. Can't trust those kind of people. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I'm not, <clears throat> I'm not sure how much more exploring I'll do. But uh came kinda came what I came to see. Right head back pretty soon here. I have to take a little break here. I'm gonna try and climb my way out of here. They might try to climb up. Back up there, we'll see what happens. Alright. Alright, well, I'm gonna go ahead and make my way out of here. I'm gonna climb up to the top up there. That's where the old road is that I wanna to get to. That's where that overlook was when we first uh, came down here, looked out over the valley. We were up there. Bones. They're probably just deer bones, hopefully. And there's some. Another one up here. Hmm. Oh yeah, there, there's the jaw. That's a deer. That's a deer jaw, or part of a deer skull. Well, we made it back, made it up to the top here. Look at that neat view up here again. Cool. All right, so overall that was a pretty cool adventure. Um, all the, everything was gated off, the mines, but that's okay. Um, just a side note about those. Um, I'm adventurous, but I'm not an idiot. You know, some people, you know, concerned about safety issues. Even if those mines were open, I wouldn't have gone like into them. I don't have the proper equipment, like a gas meter and some other things. So um, I'm not advising you to go into mines if they are open like that. So. I would love to find an open one, but I wouldn't necessarily, uh, you know, go exploring deep into it without someone else with me and without some of the proper equipment. So, just wanted to throw that in there. All right, so I'm headed back to the truck. Um, thanks for coming along, and I'll see you somewhere else again.